Well, they say it never stops raining in Manchester. It's a typically grey night here at Old Trafford, but we're expecting plenty of colour out there on the pitch. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary, as always, is Lee Dixon. And Borussia Dortmund are the team under pressure going into the second leg of this Champions League tie. It is Manchester United facing Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Dortmund with plenty of work to do after that first leg. Not quite good enough, really. They'll need a better performance tonight if they're to progress to the next round. chosen this particular shape This is the lineup for Dortmund. Thank you, old chap. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely. That takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organization, force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, if you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. And now this Champions League round of 16, second leg is underway. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Casemiro. Diogo Dallo. Danny Ceballos. Now Casemiro. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Let's see what he has in store for them. Corner awarded to Manchester United. And a deep corner into the centre of the area. And the corner far too close to the goalkeeper. On the ball, Mohamed Elianoussi. Dolberg has it. Valentin Rosier. Well, he's setting the table for his team. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. It's with Ducouré. Ndidi. Pulisic. Oh, dear. I think he's left his shooting boots behind in the dressing room. Well, it was well worth the effort. Poor technique, really. Should do better than that. Diogo Dallo. Casemiro. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Lee, in particular, what do you expect to see from his game? Well, his ball possession will be his key. People give him the ball because they know he links the play. You give him the ball. Oh, he's really up on the map here. And a Dortmund corner here. And over comes the corner. It goes begging Lee. That could have been the ticket back into the game. Well, two goals down. You can't keep wasting chances like this. It's with Ducouré. Ndidi. And a strong tackle. On the ball, Mohamed Elianoussi. 
Anderson to Riska. And they've scored! An important goal, but still a mountain to climb. They need two more goals because of the away goals rule. Hit the target, tick, power, tick, goal, tick. So on aggregate, it stands at 3-2. move count a really sumptuous ball and on the volley that's not exactly how he intended to catch it well it's worth a chance one in ten it goes in the top corner nine out of ten goes where it did do indeedy it's with Ducure. now indeedy tremendous intuition to win it back He's just a thorough reader of the game. And there we saw it. Well, it's a fine-looking Dortmund attack. But the question is, what can they do from this position? And De Gea untroubled. He's given it away. with Anderson Tariska. Dolberg has it. Now, what can he do here? Whatever it takes to keep them out. And it is a Dortmund corner. They've taken this corner short. Good tackle. Casemiro. Jimenez. Carrying a genuine threat here. Good idea, that particular move, but not to be. Casemiro with plenty to think about. Casemiro. Well, let's see, does he mean business? Delivered into the area here, and he's clear his lines. Indeedy. Pulisic now. Danny Ceballos given away by Manchester United intelligent threaded pass here Diogo Dallo on the ball well they are on the wrong end of the scoreline but Lee your overall thoughts on their current situation well this Dortmund side just needs to up the tempo a little bit more in the second half put a bit more pressure on the opposition they've done reasonably well in this first half the team's nearly clicking, but it's just not quite there. And putting his body on the line. And here's Ndidi. Will there be a tangible end product? Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Is he going to punish them here? Well, can he make this move count? Not messing around with that clearance. United getting players forward and moving the ball around. Now, what can he do here? The object of the exercise is to keep them out. And United have the corner, and he's fired over the corner. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Dukure, and given away by Jotman. Carrying a genuine threat here. Danny Ceballos. The fourth official is indicated. Let's see, does he mean business? Two minutes. Corner given to United. And a deep ball in. Attending to his defensive chores. Will there be a tangible end product? An effective challenge. The first half story has been written here at Old Trafford tonight. And now this Champions League.
So the Champions League round of 16, second leg. The second half is underway. Pulisic now. Ducure. Kasper Dolberg. And using his strength to shield the ball. Rosier with it. Dolberg has it. On the ball, Mohamed Elianoussi. It's an enterprising Dortmund attack. Can they take advantage of the situation? Teamwork might be the key. Well, they did have possession of the ball, but all that good work now counts for nothing. And there's the feed into the box. Corner coming up for Dortmund. And a deep corner into the centre of the area. Well, that helps the cause. Level on aggregate, but trailing on away goals. They need another. Well, here it is. How do you like him? In an open goal, please. No goalkeeper, no defenders. Where were they all? Sheer entertainment. 3-3 three, three on aggregate. Kasper Dolberg. Elianusi. Beautifully timed. And that is offside. Here's a change for Manchester United. Kasper Dolberg. Now in Didi. He's protecting it well. The tackle crisp and accurate. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. the crossbar and no nonsense defensive clearance so a throw in here well, let's see what he has in store for them and a strong tackle Pereira Casemiro And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Is he going to punish them here? Read it superbly to take back possession. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, sadly, from their point of view, it petered out. Tremendous ball played through. And the ball is in the net. Well, the offside flag has been raised. No goal. Well, it was close, but he just went a little bit too early. Now, what can he do here? Rosier with it. Dolberg has it. Joe Gomez. Pulisic now. And it's a story of forward momentum from Borussia Dortmund. Can they produce? lines Casemiro and the shot decidedly lacking accuracy well he had other options as well but he chose to shoot and a substitution in the offing Dahoud it's with Dahoud and it's Ruben Dias here's Tielemans
Anderson Taliska. Anderson Taliska. And a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort. He smashed it. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Casemiro acquitting himself magnificently to win it back. Elianusi. Well, can he make this move count? Dahoud. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? And Pulisic has it. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. They couldn't maintain possession. Anderson Taliska. He has teammates to play it to. Just wanted to get it out of there. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Here's Tielemans. Kasper Dolberg. Pulisic. Will there be a tangible end product? Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Oh, surely. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Borussia Dortmund have given it away. It's a weighted pass. Up a dead end, alas. Dahoud. Dolberg has it. Gomez now. Pulisic now. Joe Gomez. It's with Anderson Tariska. And it's Ruben Diaz. Dahoud. The and the referee is going to add on three minutes. Three minutes of time. And Dortmund committed to getting forward. Can they grab a late winner? Tielemans. He just keeps going. No let up. Good tackle. And so it is, full time, the referee blows his whistle, and it's Manchester United who prevail, it's Manchester United who move on. Well, yeah, Derek, they're through, but by the skin of their teeth, but that's what that rule's there for, the away goal rule. And I'm a big fan of it, to be honest with you. It does set the game up sometimes to be a bit defensive, but you know the rules before they start, play well away from home, get that away goal, it gives you a big advantage.